Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we're diving into some really exciting news, the upcoming DJI Mini 5 Pro drone. This drone is set to release in September 2024, and it's packed with some amazing features that are sure to take your aerial photography and videography to the next level. Let's break down everything you can expect from this new release. First, let's talk about the design. The DJI Mini 5 Pro is going to look pretty similar to the previous Mini drones, keeping the same compact size and weight under 250 grams. This lightweight design makes it super easy to carry around, whether you're hiking up a mountain or just flying it around your backyard. But here's the cool part. The Mini 5 Pro is going to come in a sleek new black color. This color makes the drone look even more stylish and sophisticated. So it's not just a great tool, but also a pretty cool accessory to show off. Now, even though the Mini 5 Pro won't have 360 degree obstacle sensors, which would let it detect obstacles all around, it will come with vertical recording capability. This feature is really exciting because it means you can record awesome vertical videos that are perfect for social media platforms like Instagram or TikTok. So if you're into content creation, this could be a game changer for you. Moving on to the camera, this is where things get really interesting. The Mini 5 Pro is rumored to have a one inch image sensor, similar to the one found in DJI's Osmo Pocket 3. This sensor is going to seriously boost the image quality, giving you sharper details, richer textures, and better colors. The camera will also perform much better in low light conditions, so if you like shooting in the evening or early morning, you're going to get brighter, more vibrant footage. There's also talk that the Mini 5 Pro might use the same camera as the Mavic Air 2S, which could bring even more advanced features to the table. Now let's get into the transmission and battery life. The Mini 5 Pro will have a longer transmission range, allowing you to fly your drone up to 23 kilometers away, which is an improvement over the previous 20 kilometers. This extended range gives you a lot more freedom to explore and capture footage from faraway places. The battery life is also getting a boost, increasing from 34 minutes to 40 minutes. You can stay in the air longer and capture more content without having to land and recharge as often. Plus, the internal storage is getting a big upgrade too, going from two gigabytes to eight gigabytes, giving you plenty of space to save your footage directly on the drone. When it comes to obstacle detection, the Mini 5 Pro will feature improved AI-powered sensors that help it navigate tricky environments more accurately. While it may still struggle in highly complex places like dense forests, this new system will still provide better safety and give you more confidence during flights, especially in less complicated areas. There are also a few unconfirmed features that could really set the Mini 5 Pro apart from the competition. For example, there's talk of a dual camera setup with a telephoto lens for close-ups and a variable aperture on the main camera, which would allow you to control depth of field and exposure much more precisely. If these features turn out to be true, they would give users even more creative control and make the Mini 5 Pro an excellent choice for professionals and content creators. Now, should you upgrade to the Mini 5 Pro? Well, it depends on what drone you're currently using. If you're still flying a Mini 2, the Mini 5 Pro's upgrades make it a great choice, especially with all the new features and improved performance. But if you're already using a Mini 3 Pro or Mini 4 Pro, the improvements in the Mini 5 Pro might not be enough to justify the upgrade. In that case, you could consider paying up a discounted Mini 3 Pro, which still offers great features at a lower price point. So there you have it. We're really looking forward to testing the DJI Mini 5 Pro when it's officially released and we'll bring you a full review once we had a chance to put it through its paces. If you found this preview helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe for more tech updates and reviews. Also, share this video with your friends and family who might be interested in drones. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video.